Okay. Hey guys, Tequila here again with Southern Twang. Today I'm going to be reviewing Vermont Village's turmeric and honey sipping vinegar. I got it right, yeah. So, um, I have been reviewing two of their other flavors. I did the blue blueberries and honey, and I also did the ginger and honey. So if you have not seen those reviews, just look down here below, and I have provided the links for you. So I will have to say that this Vermont Village, the um, turmeric and honey, uh, I saved it for last because I'm really not that excited about tasting this one just because um, I don't think I will enjoy drinking turmeric. But with that being said, the reason that I am going to do it anyway is because turmeric um, has a lot of great anti-inflammatory properties. And a lot of people don't know that um, I used to suffer with episodes of inflammation in my joints where it got to the point that sometimes it would bring tears to my eyes and I have a very high um, pain tolerance. I would have to take like 800 milligrams of ibuprofen and wear wrist sprays and the pain moved around from my uh, joints. It started when I was pregnant with my first son. I had carpal tunnel. It's nothing they could do for it other than operate and from what I heard that was hit or miss. So the pain would sometimes be in my hip. It would sometimes be in like my shoulders or my arms. I remember remember one time I was working at a daycare and I couldn't even lift the child up all the way because my arms were hurting so bad and I couldn't even comb my hair so it just moves all around so um, I have a, a lady that I went to church with she suffers from a bad case of arthritis and she was the one who um, hit me to the game with the turmeric and she told me about how she had cut out red meat and that had really helped her and so I was like you know what I'm gonna do the same thing so that's a whole nother story but I did you know come off of, of red meat of beef and pork um, and I occasionally you know for the holidays allow myself just to have a little and this past Thanksgiving I did the same thing and I paid because I got another episode of pain it wasn't too bad but it's, it was it made me remember why I've gone off of pork and, and beef and red meat so with all of that being said, I am still going to taste the turmeric and honey just because if it's going to work, it's going to help, you know, keep inflammation from my body. I'm all for it. So um, I gave it a good shake down at the bottom. It settles really bad. This one does. I've shaken it so you can't really see, but it was just coating the bottom here. So make sure you give it a good shake. And so I've poured it up here and I'm going to smell it smells like like hot sauce <laughs> it smells like hot sauce a little bit so i'm really not excited about taking this but i'm gonna take it see how it tastes yeah that doesn't taste good at all it tastes like um hot sauce and honey and vinegar but again if it does what it's supposed to do, then it, a little shot is not going to kill me. So I thank you for joining me. If you have any questions, don't be afraid to comment down below. And thanks for tuning in to Southern Twang.